this chicken tomato stew is everything. There, welcome back. Today we'll be making chicken stew, and for this recipe, we'll be using smoked chicken, some diced onions, chicken bouillon cubes, onion and pepper mix, canned tomato sauce. If this is your first time here, welcome, and please do not forget to subscribe and click the bell button. To my existing subscribers, thank you for tagging along. So, this is our smoked chicken already put in the pot, you can see. And um, I would like to steam my um, smoked chicken whenever I'm using it because it still has some kind of like um, cooked um, parts and some bones that are cooked and kind of red. So, so if I don't do that, I don't feel comfortable. I feel I'm eating um, raw meat or raw blood. So I'll be adding in my grated garlic and ginger. I always love to use garlic and ginger because it has a, a very good nutritional value and the aroma is very very good so i'll be adding my onions actually i also need um some chicken stock so if i don't do this how will i get chicken stock to use for my stew then i'll be adding um chicken cubes to add some taste also I'll be adding just a little salt I don't need so much because it's roasted just a little salt then some water a little water I don't need so much water I just need some stock so I'll be adding just reasonable quantity I'm so sorry the noise is um, quite I have some noise coming out from um, outside it's quite a little bit noisy please bear with me I believe the time I'm doing this video is a little bit wrong so the wrong timing but bear with me please I think this is ready now. We're taking out the chicken, transferring it into a bowl. So I used this oil, um, vegetable oil, initially to fry um, chicken. So I'll be using it for um, the stew we're preparing. We are going to allow the vegetable oil to heat um, before we put in onions and other things that we need to put into the oil. So our oil is hot now and um, we'll be putting in our onions. Some people are saying, I know some people are saying, ah, ah, but this is how I do it now. Yes, this is how you do it. But I don't know. Just still watch, okay? So our, our onions will just fry up a little. Then I'll be putting in um, this is uh, onions, um, bell pepper, and um, a bit of tomato mix in here, so it's thick. So I'll be putting it into the oil so that it can fry with the onions in the oil. Yeah, some people don't do it exactly like this. <laughs> some people just pour um, the meat inside the main tomatoes. But what I do, and um, which has really worked well for me, give it that tasty um, tomato stew. After putting my onions, I fry, I put in my tomato paste, 
and I fry it together, it makes a whole lot of difference. Try it and see. It does make a whole lot of difference. While it's frying, you just um stare. Just let it fry, you know, a little. To make tomato stew is not a difficult thing. Um, I know this is something that is popular in Nigeria because we make a lot of stew. We eat a lot of stew. So we use it to eat different things. Rice, yam, even put it in soup, you know. Or probably maybe some other countries, probably maybe in the US, the Europe, and the, I, I, I don't know, I'm just saying. Um, probably the way we make our stew is not the way they make their own stew. But I tell you, if you're not African or you're not a Nigerian, this method of making stew is amazing. So amazing. You can see it's frying, it's coming together, not um, like the same paste that was just poured into the oil. I think I'm okay with the way it has fried. This is, a, this is fresh tomatoes, not boiled to thick. I'll be using this because it's quite it's just easy for me. So now I'll pour the tomato sauce into, um, into the pot. No, we don't waste. So, <laughs> Nigerians must make sure that you know, whatever it is that they are using or they are eating, they get everything out. It's not easy to get that money, you know. Anyway, so I'll be covering this just to boil for a few minutes. Okay, so it's boiling. So what I'll do now, I'll just stir a little bit. And now I'll be adding um, the stock. From what I observed from this um, canned tomato sauce that I used, it's quite um, smooth. It's very, it's been grinded very, very smooth. If I buy tomatoes from the market and I'm grinding it um, using my blender or using the engine, um, I usually don't like grinding my tomatoes to be this smooth. It will be um, almost smooth, but not this smooth. But it's still fine, and because this is what I have um, available, cover and allow it to boil for some minutes. So our stew is boiling. And right about now, we will be adding our chicken seasoning into the pork, and salt to taste. We don't want to add so much, so I think that should be okay for now. If it isn't enough, then we can add. We'll add our curry masala. I love curry masala a lot because it has a um, combination of different spices. You know, name it cumin, um, turmeric, um, thyme, a whole lot. So I love masala. And it has a very good flavor um, and aroma to your dish. Well, I like using it for my stew. So you like to stir that. Taste. It is so tasty. And I mean it when I say that. The last thing here now is to put our chicken. 
smoked chicken, like I said earlier. That's what I'll be using. Really love the um, taste of smoked chicken. Just make sure the chicken, you know, just stay properly. Then we cover like um, three minutes and we are good. If this is your first time here, you're welcome. And thank you for watching this video. And if you haven't subscribed to my channel, please subscribe. Um, click the notification button to be notified as soon as I upload a new video. This is a channel where you get to see a lot of interesting and informative videos. And also, to my existing subscribers, I say thank you for tuning in again. Thank you for watching, um, coming back to watch this video. I really appreciate you guys a lot. And please, remember to give this video a thumbs up. Thank you. Wow, smoked chicken stew is ready. Now you see how I made this chicken stew. You can try it. If you've never tried this method, you can try it and um, let me know the outcome in the comment section and tell me what you think about this stew. Thank you guys for watching. I really appreciate it. You guys see you in my next video bye